Wilkins here, live and direct from Brooklyn, New York City. Let's go in front of me today, 2021-22 SPX. Let's flex the specs on SPX. So the price has dipped down under $75. It's a buy. I've already done a video of this stuff in great detail, so check that out. You can also see in the background, I have boxes from 2005 and 2015. Did not pay $1,200 for that box. Paid $350 plus tax or something. Uh, but yeah, I will break them at some point in time, but let's get into this one because this one is a bargain at these price points. Configuration, one card per pack, four packs per box, four cards total, 20 bucks per case. Base at one through one, honey. Uh, rookie auto jerseys would be 63 cards. The shadow boxes would be 33 cards and the shadow box autos would be 29 cards. So those are kind of true rookies, even though they're lettered cards. So within a box break, you expect your two auto mems or auto mems and then two tech cards. And you can look for all kinds of other goodies within this product, like the double X duo materials, the pride of the nation, which are cool, the rookie superscripts, the obsidians, which are beautiful. I really like the lustrous uh, RPAs. Of course, there's clarity variants of those and there's radiance FX and all kinds of stuff, but we're just gonna get into it today. This box felt really light. So that is the one disclaimer, unfortunately. It might just be a super script within here, we'll see. All right, let's roll. Kind of interesting, for a couple of years there, they didn't have true rookies in the true sense of numbered cards. All right, oh, this is our hit. This is our hit right off the scoop here, right off the bat. So we did hit a Tice Thompson. You know, the rookie jerseys are some of the nicest cards, the rookie auto jerseys, I have to say. This is a beautiful card. I collect these, so very, very nice. That is, and you know, are these hard signed? I'd say they're hard signed. I'd say they're hard signed. Uh, and there is pack number two, and we hit a Laffy. Oh, wait a second. We have an Obsidian rookie behind us. We have two cards here, so we have a bonus card in here. That is very nice. And it is just a base Obsidian Rookie. So we did hit a black, if you will, a Wade Allison Black. All right. So three cards and two packs. I guess the way to do it would just be to turn it around. This feels like a finite, I'm guessing. We'll see. And it, oh, look at that, a Carey Price. So it is a Radiance FX Carey Price. Very nice, this is a base. So beautiful card, I'm sure people collect these. I have to say a little bit of damage on the bottom, which is crazy considering all the individual packaging. Last pack here, this does feel thicker, so that could be good. Of course, I would like something like a black. So let's see, oh, it's thick, whatever. This might just be a base patch, I'm thinking, but there's only one way to find out. So <laughs> what a quick break, right? Super thick card though, super, super thick card. And who do we have here? Well, is it horizontal? There's only one way to find out. I think it's a horizontal card. So what is this? Uh, uh, well, well, that won't be Connor Bedard, not in 2021-22. Oh, look at this, a Mike Hardman patch. That is beautiful. That is a sick patch. Wow, is that a beautiful patch. Only numbered to 35, so that's a great hit. This is actually a really solid box of this stuff. Um, at these price points, of course, uh, you know, $75, you really can't go wrong. So I wouldn't say they're the best players, but I think it was actually a pretty decent box. We hit a little bit of everything, a nice smattering of everything. We hit an auto, a Jersey auto, we hit a Carey Price Radiance, we did hit an Obsidian, we hit the Laffy Jersey. Uh, this probably would be the hit of the box, or maybe the Mike Hartman might be the hit of the box. That's a beautiful card. That is a beautiful patch. Uh, it will go up on com C if you want it. Uh, only number to 35, that is a sick patch. So that's basically it guys, really solid boxes, stuff at the $65 price point or whatever. Uh, five cards, of five hits, uh, as opposed to just four hits, uh, including one tech, but the rest were actually just mems or auto jerseys and stuff like that are jerseys. So I'd say it was a solid box. Do look for 2024, 25. They've gone back to the eight pack, I think three card configuration. I am so for that. It is, you know, long in the tooth. I've been wanting this for a long time. So I'm really, really hopeful that uh, the new SPX will be uh, much better, like its old configurations, like in the background. I uh, hope you enjoyed that, guys. That'd be full cards. Do me on our sub liking hashtag and drive full cards live and direct from a place called Brooklyn, New York City. That was great. That was pretty cool. Mm -hmm.